We live in an age of increasing concern about heart disease, cancer, and a host of modern diseases which afflict our generation. Health is a number one concern of millions despite the knowledge of modern medical science. Why is this? Seemingly, many allow destructive emotions such as jealousy, hatred, revenge, and bitterness to dominate their lives. There are also people who have bad health habits, lack self-control, work too much, come in contact with dangerous chemicals and pollutants, and neglect proper sleep and exercise. To keep our bodies fit, we don't need to engage in the more strenuous forms of exercise. In the Holy Land, in biblical times, Israelites stayed lean and hard because the majority used their legs to get where they were going. The Bible tells us how Jesus and his followers walked the length and breadth of the Holy Land throughout the Lord's public ministry, for example. Today, the majority of people do not exercise because it sounds so hard, but brisk walking provides many of the same benefits as more intensive activities like jogging or aerobics. Developing a routine to walk at a reasonably vigorous pace for 30 minutes to an hour three times a week is not very complicated. Begin your walking program at a pace with which you and your walking partners are comfortable. The Bible in the book of Proverbs criticizes lazy people who don't do enough work. Matthew chapter 5 verse 41 says, If someone forces you to go one mile, go with him two miles. In 1 Timothy chapter 4 verse 8, the Bible tells us we should exercise regularly. It says, For bodily exercise profiteth little, but godliness is profitable unto all things, having promise of the life that now is, and of that which is to come. Exercise does not need to be vigorous to benefit you. Doctors now say that walking is one of the best exercises. Although it's the most simple of all aerobic exercises, walking still provides all of the benefits that the more rigorous forms involve. Metabolically, it helps control weight, blood sugar, and cholesterol levels. A brisk walk can burn up to 100 calories per mile or 300 calories per hour. By it, the circulation of the blood is greatly improved, keeping the body fit, proving what the Bible describes in Leviticus chapter 17 verse 11. The life of the flesh is in the blood. What is in the blood constitutes life. Also in Proverbs chapter 14 verse 30, a sound heart is the life of the flesh, but envy the rottenness of the bones. As an aerobic exercise, walking when it energizes the brain also strengthens the heart as it gets it beating faster to transport oxygen-rich blood from the lungs to the muscles. Active walking also strengthens the bones and helps to prevent the onset of osteoporosis. Psychologically, walking generates an overall feeling of well-being and can relieve depression, anxiety, and stress by producing endorphins, the body's natural tranquilizer. The Bible promotes natural remedies that enhance our health and well-being and walking can be the easiest and most natural method to do so. The health-promoting discoveries of 20th century medical science that the Bible had already taught 2,000 and more years ago confirms how authentic the Bible is.